American singer, songwriter and front man for One Republic, Ryan Tedder returns with not only this hit under his belt, but also this one he helped produce with our own Sam Frost. Now Ryan and One Republic are back with their new hit, Kids. Apparently the first song Ryan ever learnt on piano was Stevie Wonder's I Just Called to Say I Love You. Fun fact, the first song I learnt on piano was Hot Potato by the Wiggles, which explains why I never had a career in music. (laughs) Welcome back to the show, Ryan Tedder. Hey. (laughs) What an introduction. (laughs) (laughs) Only the best for you, Ryan. Now, is that true about you learning Stevie Wonder when you were a kid? It is. I was five years old. We had a little upright piano, and that was the first song I ever learned. And then I actually ended up working with Stevie this past month for the first time doing something. I can't say what it is, but it's with a huge pop artist that's current, that's very, very young. And they did a duet, and I ended up producing and writing it. And I lost my marbles because the first day we were in the studio, I told him that that was the first song I'd ever learned, and he just busted right into it. He just started playing it right there. Oh, oh so you was, cried. You would have cried. Kind of full circle. Yeah, that's incredible. I did. It started falling. <laughs> <laughs> it was incredible. He told me the story of how he wrote it and what it was about and when he wrote it and what he was doing. And maybe I can say I probably shouldn't say so. Yeah, lot, do it. Like, I just, <laughs> yeah, just put it out there. Um, <laughs> yeah, I just did a, a record with, um, I can say Stevie Wonder. I can't say who the big pop star is that's featured with him, but it's a... Uh, Huge record, I think, God willing, for a film coming up. And it's a big oh. film. I just finished it today, as a matter of fact. So wow, um, we just got a version today that I think everybody's happy with. Ryan, One Republic's new single, Kids. Now, I heard that you actually recorded and thought of this melody in 30 seconds. Is that right? That is a true statement. You know, I kind of wrote it all at once. I was driving around listening to the music and then the chorus just jumped out at me and hit me and I knew exactly what the song was going to be about and what to say. Very few songs happen that way where they they happen that quick and you never know if it's going to be a big record or not or people are going to love it or not, but um, Kids was very quick. On this album, you're collaborating with Pharrell, The Chainsmokers, Everyone Wants to Know, your special friend, Ed Sheeran. Can we expect a collaboration, please? (laughs) <laughs> I'm afraid not on this album. No, we, we actually briefly talked about it a few weeks ago because there was a song that we did together. But um, as you're recording and you're running against a deadline, you just run out of time. Last time we were together was about a month ago. And um, it was just, by the time I got back from the K, I was just like, man, I don't know how. I have nine other songs I have to finish. I don't know how to add this one to the list. So... I have no doubt in the future there'll be a collaboration, probably the very near future. But between Pharrell, I was actually just talking with him literally 10 minutes before you called, because um, he's recording the song today, actually. And Cassius and Peter Gabriel and Santa Gold. So it's all kind of come together at the last minute. Uh, for the record, just before this interview, I was on the phone to my wife to let her know I'll pick up some milk on the way home. <laughs> um, I mean, it's kind of like Pharrell. It's kind of like Pharrell. Yeah, exactly. Now, Ryan, you are a dad. Um, Your oldest is six. Are you at the point in life where now the kids are ruling the playlist in the house? I already have far too much of the Frozen soundtrack that gets played in our place. (laughs) Where are you at? Yeah, well, I'll tell you, our kids, they definitely love music. Our youngest kid, he wants every single day to watch the Minions. So, you know, Despicable Me, and then they did Minions. Ah, nah, well, nah, he, he nah, it, nah, 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 nah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because the beginning of the movie, they go, ba, 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 ba. You know, they do, like, all the Minions are singing the 20th Century Fox theme song or whatever movie company it is. So he calls it Baba because that's, that's mm. all he, he does. He can't sing Minions yet. So every single day, seven days a week, we're watching Minions at, like, seven in the morning. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> Well, congratulations. Not only do you have physical kids, but also the latest single, (laughs) Kids, from One Republic. It's out now. Always a pleasure. Thanks so much, Ryan Tedder. Thanks so much, Ryan. Thank you, guys. Talk soon.